What's up, man? It's your big bro train. You tuned in again to another divine video. This message just came to me in a download as I was just sitting here just chilling. All right. So um, I don't know what you're going through. I don't know what your situation is. I don't know what you're facing right now. I don't know what you was thinking before you started watching this video. I don't know where you at. If you in the car, if you at work, if you at home, then I got a message for you. Okay. I got a message for you because somebody sent me an email and was like, big bro trend. Why come your videos lately have been focused on negativity? Did you change? Listen, folks. I'm just like you. I'm just like you, okay? Just because I'm on here making videos don't mean that I'm not human. You feel me? We all have feelings. We all go through phases on our journey. And it's just so happened that you have to see me go through my tough times as, as well as my good times. And I'm not going to hide my tough times like some people do. I'm not going to. I'm not going to play a role like I'm having a good day when I'm really having a bad day. I'm just going to I'm just going to keep reminding myself that there are bad days and there are good days like you should. Some days you're going to have bad days. Some days we're going to have good days because this is a journey. It's only a process. Everything that's going on in the world right now. This is what I really know. OK, but like I said, sometimes it's hard to come out of that. That way of thinking sometimes when you a chosen one, sometimes everything could be crashing around you to the point that you lose touch of like who you really are. But that's human. That's a part of being human. It's human nature. OK, but it's so much stuff going on right now in the world, folks, that it's kind of hard not to see it. But at the same time, this is what you have to keep in mind if you're a real true chosen one. If you are a real true chosen one and only if you are a real true divine chosen one, you, you know for a fact that whatever's happening in the world, it will not really affect you. It won't. Whatever's happening around you, it it could be a thousand people fall at your right. Two thousand people don't call you that you got numbers in your phone. It don't matter who is doing whatever they doing to you. At the end of the day, if you are a chosen one, you always going to win. That's always how it's always has been. That's how it will be today. That's how it will be tomorrow. So I don't know what your situation like, what you going through, what type of tough times you facing. Just know you ain't the only one that can that see tough times. But I know for a fact that these moments will pass. You is not going down. You is not going backwards. If you are true chosen one, you know this has always been your life from the jump. It's only going to get better for you. What's happening right now is a shift in your life. All right, you're going to you're going through a shift because I'm going through a shift and I'm projecting because we multidimensional beings. If I if I understand you, you understand me, then we understand each other, then we must be soul tribe people. You feel me? And so we going through a shift, but that don't mean that we going down or we gonna fail or we not gonna make it. We are making it. That's the reason why. We going through another breakthrough, another shift. I know that for a fact, but even see the thing that scares you is it's like, why are you going through this shift? Nobody never knows what's on the other side of that door. Why they, why they going through this shift? Nobody never really knows what to expect when you've done. Listen, when you've done the most that you can possibly do, right? And you know, for a fact, if you've done the best that you can, I don't know who I'm talking to, but if you know, you tried, you tried plan A, you tried plan B, C, D, you tried to do this, that didn't work. You trying to do this today, it's still like something ain't working, some things are not happening. When you are in the eye of a hurricane 
and it's all turbulence around you to where you can't go nowhere but stay in that calm out of the hurricane, then this means that it is out of your control, okay? And see, one thing you got to understand is that sometimes we as chosen ones, we got so much free reign to do so much great things and we got so much influence and so much charisma, right? And, and, and people naturally do things for us because we're just favorited. You got to understand Sometimes there comes a point to where it's enough. All right. It's enough. I've seen you work hard. I've seen you put in the efforts. You know what I'm saying? You've stretched your faith. You've kept believing. You didn't give up. You stopped doing some things that you've been doing just recently even. But guess what? Now it's out of your control. As you shifting, you going through a breakthrough right now. If you're watching this video up until this point, then you definitely are going through a breakthrough phase right now where every, the key word in breakthrough, break, meaning separate, pull apart, and then through, meaning still progress and go through everything that's breaking. And if that's what's happening to you right now, that's what you experiencing. You are going through breakages. OK, you are going through uh, turbulence like an airplane in the sky. It don't mean you're not going to land. You're going to land and get to your destination, but it's just going to be a little turbulence. You feel me? That's the same thing that's happening right now in the chosen one's life. You feel me? But at the end of the day, you always get the last laugh, chosen one. You never listen. I don't know what you're going through. Again, I do not have any idea what you're going through, but I know it's a setup for your success. You just not used to doing it this way. You just not used to the move. You just not used to the transition. But even if you're in a position right now where something is transitioning to where you have to navigate to a different course, whatever that course might be, and you're not used to it, of course, you're going to feel some kind of way. Of course, you're going to feel down and out like big bro trends. Sometimes when I be getting on here and y'all be thinking I'd be negative. Of course, you're going to you're going to be you're going to get frustrated. Of course, because it seemed like you, you, you don't have no control over nothing no more. You feel me? See, when God is working, sometimes he shut and cut off your supply to where you don't catch no fish in that part of the lake. You know, sometimes he shut it off to where you don't. You don't get nobody to, to reach out to you on days when you hurt the most. You know what I mean? Everything is transitioning to where you are becoming a totally new being. And sometimes God got to break you down all the way to this level. Sometimes he got to break you down all the way to this level because sometimes you was disobeying him. Okay. For the things that you was doing. OK, before the breakthrough actually happened to where it gets to a point where you can't do it yourself any longer. Although you did try and although you did sustain the effort and you kept the vibe and you kept the energy going, you still didn't do it to the perfection that he wanted. And see, this is why God always, always forgives us. And this is why God is always unconditionally loving for us because he know that when we trust in his son, you feel me? When we trust in the most high, when we trust in Christ, he carried the burden for us. Now, see, if, if Christ never died for us, our sins, then yes, everything around you will crash. It will destruct it will break. There will never have been a through. It will just fall down. But this is not your battle. You see what I'm saying? You see where I'm going here? This is not your workings. You do some of the job, he do the rest. And if you're watching this video right now, you've done your best. And I'm letting you know, God is doing the rest right now as we speak. It might not be the way you want it to be. You might lose some people. You might lose some material things. You again, you might have to relocate. You might have to recalibrate. 
But that don't mean that you're not going to get to where you're going to go and you're not going to be still living your dream. Chosen ones never fail. They never fade. Chosen ones, we are the most favorited people on the face of the earth. You know why? Because we don't even ask, ask for favor. We don't even ask to be separated. We don't. We never ask for this. We never ask to be better than other people. We don't even act like it. But somehow it just lands on us. Somehow people just magically just don't like us without us having to do anything to them. Somehow people just never choose us. They never chose us. Remember? They never liked us. Remember? But God chose us even though everybody else turned their back on us and everybody sold us out everybody rejected us but god accepted us and now since you with the most high now since you got that type of privilege it don't matter what's happening around you i feel sorry for a lot of people out here honestly i do and this is like i said this is why i get on these videos every day because i got a heart for people you feel me i don't know this is my purpose i got a heart for people and i just hate to see people suffering but deep down inside i feel sorry for a lot of people out there they ain't gonna make it they ain't gonna make it this go around they ain't gonna make it they ain't gonna make it and it might be your friends it might be Somebody next door to you, it might be anybody. They ain't going to make it, but you're going to be the one that makes it. How was that? Because you chosen. You a chosen one. This is normally how it goes for chosen ones. You feel me? So I don't know what you're going through right now. I just want to bring you back into alignment, okay? Because that's where I'm at right now. It took me some while to get out of it too because I'm human, all right? If y'all can't, if you out there and you subscribe to me and you can't deal with me being real, then you ain't no chosen one. You just might as well unsubscribe, okay? If you can't deal with me being humane, then you don't need to be here with us because you're not like us. <laughs> you're not like us, okay? If I was robotical, you would, you would, you would probably been un unsubscribed already. I'm not robotical. I'm not AI. I'm trend. You feel me? So don't be getting it twisted. Don't be getting it twisted. Don't be getting it twisted when I get on here and I be expressing my deepest feelings and stuff. And I know, ladies, it'd be hard for y'all to see a man express his feelings because you ain't never seen a man act like that. But guess what? I don't care what nobody think. I know what I, I know who I am. You feel me? And I know what's going on with you right now. Like I said, if you resonate with me chances are is that you're going through a big shift and a breakthrough right now and it, you couldn't do it on your own but god is intervening with your life right now and like i said if it's quiet if things have come to a standstill then you don't need to do no more thinking just shut up enjoy the moment enjoy the happiness don't know but you don't gotta happiness is the only thing that's free right now in this world as a matter of fact everything else cost happiness and oxygen is free and the damn it if you have if you breathe in today you are free to be happy so live in the moment stop worrying about the future stop worrying about what happened yesterday if you in the solidified moment right now to where you can't hear anything Ain't nothing moving for you. Ain't nothing going in your favor. Good, good, good. You should be happy. Because that means, like I said, that means you're going into a different season. A different season. I'm going into a different season. Look, y'all, I'm, I'm not bragging, but I just came across 300,000 beautiful subscribers out there like yourself. 300,000? I've been working so hard, it don't even surprise me no more. I'm trying to get 30,000. I mean, 30 million. That don't even surprise me no more. I don't even care about that stuff no more. I used to, back two or three years, two or three years ago, I probably would have been surprised. But when you come in in a new season, things have to change. You have to shift. You have to move different. You have to recalibrate. You have to sh shift your gears. You have to transition. God got to get rid of people. Let him do his thing. He got to get rid of people. He got to move you from different places. You feel me? Because you're not alone. 
He got to work on your health. He got to clean you up. He got to build you up. He got to change you. He got to change thoughts in your brain so you can get to the next breakthrough and be functioning correctly. All that has to change. Listen, don't ever be fooled by what's happening behind the scenes, okay, versus what's happening with you with your own two eyes. Faith is stuff that's not seen, bro. You can't see what's going on behind the scenes and why you're going through the phases you're going through, but you got to trust the process. Just trust the process and know, listen, if it's done worked out for you up until this point, it's going to work out for you even tomorrow. And I speak this on you right now. I speak this on you right now. You're going to win whatever battle you're facing. You're going to win it. Comment below and say, victory is mine, man. Just comment below and say, I've already won. Give this video a thumbs up if it resonated with you, man. It's your big bro trend, man. I'm about to hit the gym anyway. I'm about to hit the gym up real quick. Get out here in nature a little bit. Get some of this vitamin D out here in this Arizona sun. And if I'm feeling pretty good, I'll definitely get back on here this evening and make another video for you people that get off work. All right. So remember what I said, man. Remember that it's all a process. Don't never stop. Stop talking about the problems. Stop glorifying the problems. We all make mistakes. But remember who you are. You're a chosen one. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.